My beloved love, this is a branching out of our positive cognizance. That is when we understand we're safe and need not fear our past experiences, which is for a lot of people very difficult. Then, all additional stress and fears in our lives become nothing more than added lessons. We understand that everything in our lifetime is manageable. There's nothing we have to worry about or fear. We may then accept everything in our life as a lesson. I am still yours. It's only the time, distance and situation which is not in our favor at this present moment. As we keep moving forward with faith, things will turn better for us. Leaving you without giving any explanation was not my choice, but I needed to do it because I don't want you to forget about your dreams and purpose of life just for me. Dear soul family, I don't want to be with anyone else because I feel like no one will ever matter to me as much as you do. I know it's selfish to say this after all I did to you, but I can't help feeling love for you in my heart. I feel so irritated and frustrated when we don't talk to each other because the only thing that feels safe to me is you. To be honest, you live a more peaceful and happy life compared to me because my life is so messed up and controlled by others. I know you love me and wish to hear from me. You have grown a lot and I constantly find myself needing to catch up. I know this has to be so hard for you not to have me there. I feel very well, but I do care, and I really want to show up more. Sorry, I wish you knew just how special you are to me. It kills me not to be able to tell you. Your love made me better with your compassion and kindness through this time. Dear soul family, you exhibit such a warm and protective energy that it feels so safe to disclose my weakness. You are such a nurturing soul because, in reality, you carry beautiful feminine energy within you. I can't express how much empowered I feel in your presence. You are such a selfless and pure-hearted person, which is very hard to find in today's world. You are the only woman who touched me at a soul level in so many ways. I lied to you many times whenever you asked me about my feelings because I was too afraid to show my inner soul level emotions. That's why I always presented myself as a very rational and logical being. But in reality, there is an extreme amount of pure and unconditional love that I feel for you. You don't know how much you affect me, my love. I am not a rude, egoistic and toxic person but I keep up a facade in order to protect my heart. Dear soul family, everyone around me knows that I am not happy without you. Nothing excites me or has my attention because I am constantly thinking about you, finding it hard to focus on my day-to-day -day activities. I am feeling hurtful because you are not here with me. I wish I could take things back. I set an angle. I know love, my words and actions have hurt you a lot in the last few days. I have projected myself onto you, but I realized this lately, love. I will lose a part of myself if I lose you. From Divine Muscular Type yes, if you believe.